Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Satisfactory. In the last episode, we went over and found some more coal over in uh, this direction, over where our old base is, and uh, set that up and uh, built both the miner and a truck station. We also found some. Uh, where is it? Where did it go? Not in there. Oh, yeah, some sulfur. There it is. So I mined a hundred of those by hand and in between episodes. And I also, on the way back, found uh, some raw quartz, which uh, I also mined, of course, because we want that. And I also uh, got the uh, hard drive from the wreck that we, we can see from up around the coal area. So I think uh, what I want to do is research the hard drive. So let's get that done immediately. It'll take 10 minutes. And uh, I have also prepared so that, uh, oh, uh, by the way, in between episodes, I also unlocked Logistics Mark II. So we now have conveyor poles, stackables, and belts Mark II and lifts Mark II. So that is very nice and I have decided that we're going to go with steel production for the next uh, milestone and I have made everything ready to do that so let's get that started and send off our pod buddy there we go and milestone reached steel production unlocked Foundry and improved miner included to ensure efficiency of new pipelines. A collection of new, more complex parts is now available for crafting. See you later. Okay, so let's see. Power. Uh, no production. We have a new miner, uh, which we can't actually make yet, but uh, we will be able to. I suppose we could make steel pipes and steel beams if we hmm maybe if we made some steel ingots that is a possibility uh, what else did we get nothing really okay uh, but we did get all of the recipes here with encased industrial beams uh, steel beam, steel pipe, stator, motor, and heavy modular frame. So that's quite a few uh, new recipes that we've unlocked. So that's pretty good. Uh, in between episodes, I have also done a bit of building. So if we come over here to our central storage area, I have built both of these. And the conveyor walls are really annoying with the uh, with the wall conveyors or conveyor walls. So I have decided not to use those, but I have set up uh, ten uh, truck stations, as you can see here, five on each side. And I think we'll extend out here because we can use the other side as well here. And we'll extend out and use get five on each side as, as well here or five on the five on this side and five on the other side so that'll be a total of 20 um, truck stations on this building and we can expand we can't really expand this way because of the stupid poison but we can expand down in this direction I already did expand it a bit. I expanded it by three foundations in order to be able to get five you know, truck stations in. So there is a rock over here that is a little bit annoying, but uh, I don't know. Uh, I know that with the uh, sulfur. Oh, there's a mercosphere. I didn't notice that before. Uh, I do know that with the sulfur uh, research in the game now. Uh, there is explosive, so I don't know. Maybe we can blow it up. Uh, if we can't, it's going to 
might be a little bit annoying, but we'll have to deal with it and uh, find out what we're gonna do. But there certainly isn't room for a truck station right here. We'll see what we'll do. Uh, so the idea is here that we have two lanes, right? So one here and one here, each side of the wall. And one lane is going to go one way and the other lane is going to go the other way. So all of the trucks will come in, uh, let's say from this side on this uh, side of the wall and go out on the other. And the same goes for the other side. They will come in down there and come, go out here. So yeah. And then I also built, oh, uh, let, let's just take a look here. I think it's this one over here. I did build just to test a couple of conveyor lifts and sent them up there and see and they come up here that looks quite okay I think Unfortunately, the, the wall conveyors aren't an option for these because it just won't hook in. I have tried everything I know how to try to get it to work, but it just won't. So, nothing we can do about that. And I was thinking that here we would put a jump pad and come be able to jump up here. But maybe it's better because here we actually have... Uh, two so maybe it's better to do it over here and close this up so that we can have let's just oh, remove one of them so we can have the jump pad here and uh, jump up to this and then continue up as our building gets taller though it won't get that tall i think you'll have maybe one or two more levels than this and that's it but uh, we'll see we'll see so yeah uh, that is what has happened in between episodes uh, i have got the um, materials ready for two tractors so today we are going to set up the coal tractor that uh, we made uh, we, we set up over at the um, the old base we set up uh, gold production and a truck station and we're going to get that uh, coming over here and I think we will do all of this will be unloading and all of this over here will be loading I think so what I want to do is and I want to use, certainly want to use Mark twos. So let's just go in here and say, this is going to be three, this is going to be four. Yeah. And let's stick these in here. I guess it's gonna be like so. It's the height. Uh, it's really hard to gauge the heart, height needed. Let's come over here. That way. I think it needs to come up there. Is that right? It looks right to me. In there, I think. Yeah. And. This will let's see this is uh oh that's the input. And we need output there into there and then we actually need input from there and into there. And we can't do that because we need to set it up from the top. So, let's go and do that 
Yeah, we can do that later when we see that this is the coal is coming in. So that's that. Then we need power for all these things. And for now, it's going to have to be Mark 1 conveyor balls. Yeah, I think we'll upgrade them later, but now Mark 1 works. Let's stick it in here in the corner. Where can we have... I guess we'll put one here. And then... We'll go there. And for just for now, we can just come over to that. So that powers up. Uh, well, almost powers up. We, of course, need to hook it up as well. It makes sense. And we want this to be unloading. Good. And I think that's it. We need some uh, some fuel for the tractor, else it won't really be going anywhere, right? So I think we, I do think we have like 80 coal or something like that over here, somewhere. Nope, nope. There we have it, 84 coal, and there comes the pod. Well, let's just see the ma'am isn't done yet, right? Oh, it is. That was quick. So let's see what kind of alternative blueprint do we want to get. I do like this one. I really do like this one. But we can get that later. That's not going to be the first thing that we're going to be setting up. Uh, this one is very nice too, the screws. I think that's what we're going to do. Hmm. The iron is pretty nice too. Wait, only 11.25 per minute? Oh, dang it. Oh, I didn't choose one. Good. Uh, because these guys would smelt. That's 30 per minute. So why would I choose the other one? Oh, I'm going to get the al alternate for screws. And then we can Data start on the something hard drive else. Has been salvaged and can be repurposed to unlock an alternate recipe. Salvaging more hard drives will provide additional alternate recipes. Didn't want to do that. There we go. Uh, Twenty-five. We want in one stack. And we will get. Oh, I found some circuit boards at the the wreck site. So let's get the criteria more in there. Get a little bit closer to getting our blade runners. Begin that analysis. And I suppose it's actually time to set up the tractor. Which is always fun. So let's get a tractor going. Uh, vehicles, tractor. Build a tractor. Uh, let's just build it here, right under the thing. 
Né? That was actually perfect. I don't know what the hell it was putting in there because it didn't have anything. And it is set to... No, it's set to loading. I want it to be unloading. So there. And some fuel. <coughs> I'm gonna jump in. And so I guess this side will be this way. So we're going to say... Start recording. And go. And we'll come out here. And how are we going to get around? That's actually a good question. Guess we'll come around this way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think this trash, this path is going to be a disaster, but we'll see. And we're on our way. We need to go this way. I think we're going the right way. No, we're not. Okay, let's uh, <laughs> let's try this again. I think I need to do it from the other side because I think I need to do it from the other side because I can find my way there. Um, let's just do a bit of housekeeping. see where do we need to go and we have this uh, so we need to go that way we have this belt in the way we can get under it so it's okay I guess could we elevate it a bit I'll get rid of some trees and stuff too close to poison. Poison is mean. I'm gonna come up that way and we will be going into the poison when we come up. Which is unfortunate. And over here, I definitely want to take out some trees. There. Let's get rid of this as well. They don't regrow anyway. Didn't I get the barrel nuts? No, I didn't. Okay. So pick the barrel, nut, barrel nuts before you cut down uh, the barrel nut bush thing. Take out this tree as here as well. Oh, I shouldn't be going up there. If I get up here, something went wrong. Uh, so pick these out. Ah, I'm too impatient, which makes everything go slower. There. All of this stuff out take this stuff out. That was definitely in the way. There we go. Much better. Okay. So, let's just go grab the Mercer Sphere here as well, because that's probably gonna be a little bit in the way as well. There we go. Um, is this raw quartz? 
I think it is. No, bauxite. Let's pick that up. Get that out of the way. Are we not getting any? Yeah, we're getting it. There we go. Okay. I think we need to make a little bit of an adjustment here. So, foundations. Let's do zero. Nine, eight, seven. Because we, I think we need to come up here. Let's um, make it flow with this. And if we want to make this three wider to get another let's just do that immediately to get so we don't set up truck paths and then, and then we have to redo them because we we want to expand that would be pretty annoying so there. stuff out All right and here we'll do uh, no not up there oh yes up there because yeah it's too wide as well. Darn it! I dropped off all the, um, the concrete. Okay, this is not what I had planned for this episode, guys, but uh, it is what it is. And we'll get there. Can I get under here? Yes, I can. Very nice. But um, we'll get there. We'll get there. Just need to be a little bit patient. Which is not always a virtue of neither mine nor YouTube's. But uh, bear with me. Bear with me. Let's just jump up and run through here. I'll have a look at the glory that is our truck station. I think it looks pretty cool. I really do. Okay, so hopefully we have enough concrete now. We'll finish this up. Here. Let's make it a little longer. Get around all these rocks. Um, actually, let's just make it as long as. too many there so there we go and then we need a way to get onto it which is where these guys come in Uh. Oh. Let's 
seven. Eight. Come on, get in there. And here we go. Almost done. Just a little bit more. There. Right. That does mean that we're going to have to take some of this stuff out. This stuff needs to go as well. Alright. We're gonna drive reasonably close to the edge here. Come over here. Come down this way. Guess we'll take that little jump or what? Or will we just stick one of these in. Let's just stick one of these in, at least for now. And over here. There. Alright. So we'll come there. And come up this way. This is uh, also a one-way street. Everything is one-way streets. And that's also why I uh, reduced the height a little bit from uh, the platform. So it's kind of a little bit obvious that don't drive there. Uh, it's we need. Or do we? Actually, it's fine. Alright. We could have gone all the way over here to make it the same length as. We do that. We don't actually have the. Hmm. We have the materials for it? Probably not. Um. But I'm still going to do it. And there are going to be rocks going through, which is not great. But we'll deal with that. I mean, it's just a bit of a rocky road, right? come down and we need to go over in this direction uh, under that belt over there so the question is do I want to fix that I think I do want to fix it just a little bit a little bit Or do I? Because no, I don't. Because we we're not gonna have that belt there forever. It's very, very temporary. All right, let's go try this out again. And I know that we're getting close to. Time, but I really want to get this tractor going in this episode. So let's do it. Vehicles, tractor. Place you under here. Like that. Perfect. And give you some. Oh, drive you, and clear the path, 
Can I just clear the path? Okay. Start recording. And go. So we come out here. I do like driving these things. I think it's fun. I think it's fun. And come down here. Go around. Ooh, stupid poison. Around here. And under. Up. And then we're just following the power poles more or less. We're this way. Around this poison. Where we see the pole. And up here. And there's our truck station. Load up. Thank you. Turn around and go back. And it's much easier to find the way the other way because we can see the path nodes. So it's just to follow path that we've already taken. We need to cut that tree down, I think. And here we go. Let's go on the other side here. Hope this is safe. Yes, it is. Let's go over this way so we don't cross paths so much. Come under here. Almost home. And come into the truck station. And stop. There we go. Uh, high path nodes. Finish recording, enable autopilot, exit the video. Now it goes. And we got coal, outstanding. Our very first tractor has started. Yay. Let's take a look here. Hopefully, it makes it. There it comes. Ray. All right. Very cool. So the plan was to have done a little bit more in this episode, but my brain didn't consider that it would be hard to come around that way and maybe we should actually have come around this way now that I think about it because yeah because now we're going to be crossing paths with these guys who will be coming in from the other side and Hmm. It would have been smarter if 
this was for this side and these come in on the same side down there as well and then over here we have we would have these guys coming that way and these guys coming that way and the return over here that would actually have made sense okay i might fix that up in between episodes but we'll see but uh, that's going to be it for this guy time, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I will see you next time.